A lot of times during the development of a, a game, and this is any game, but specifically with The Sims, you're experimenting with the technology and trying to figure out what you can do with it and what sort of things you can make happen. And a lot of times things that you don't expect happen. And so we have, we try to capture those and keep track of them because they make us laugh and, and we enjoy seeing them play back. And, and some of the most humorous moments are things that you didn't expect. When we were trying to test out the juggling, for example, uh, we wanted to see if we could have them juggle objects that are in the world, and we needed something that animated, so we ended up using the baby. And so you see them juggling the baby, which you're never going to have that in the game, but as a, as a cool, kind of fun technology exploration, um, it's great. And then a lot of times you also have technical glitches that you'll see manifest themselves in really weird ways, and you can't help but laugh out loud. And like locomotion, which is how sims move from one place to another, and and so, for example, in the swimming pool, we have to have a swimming locomotion. It's how they move around. But it's funny when you apply it to their normal locomotion, you see them moving around the house as if they're swimming. And so we goof around all the time. And actually, features do often come out of just our goofing around with our technology. Oh, wow, look how cool it is that they can do that. Or I never thought they'd be able to do this. And so definitely that experience of playing with what we've got and figuring out how the technology can benefit the game is part of the development process. So our job is obviously to make sure that a lot of these things that we don't intend don't ship in the product. I mean, these are bugs, but some of them are so funny, you just can't help but hold on to them. And you do want to share them almost. You'd love to be able to put them in the game just for people to be able to see them, because some of them are just truly hilarious. And often, I mean, these are, these are often things that do end up being Easter eggs in the game. You know, I don't, want, I don't want people to go looking for any of these particular ones, but sometimes those really wacky, crazy things that can happen do end up being Easter eggs that we leave in just for the heck of it.